looks like a big, like basically a big cookie that's going to bite at him. Have you seen the solar eclipse before? Uh, uh no. no. It's not crossing the sun from left to right. It's crossing the sun no, from... Yeah! Yeah! Oh, wow. Yeah. That is really cool. Crazy. It's a half a moon. It's so cool. Oh, yeah, okay. Pretty cool. I can see the moon. That is so perfect. Oh, my God. It looks like the sun's in half. Oh, wow. It's even better now. No, we might have close to 10 telescopes, maybe. But, no, but none of them see through clouds. <laughs> we have one small opening in the telescope. Okay. okay, and then I've got it going through an eyepiece, and you can calculate the distance of the funnel to come into focus. So the certain millimeter eyepiece with a certain millimeter focal length telescope, you can calculate the length of that, and then you can get the image. It happens to be a, a six-inch Newtonian reflector named after Sir Isaac Newton, who made the first practical one in about 1670. And uh, the reason they made went to reflectors with mirrors was because the original refracting telescopes like the Galileo used, they didn't have a good enough technique to grind the lenses. They had very bad what they call chromatic aberration. So in other words, they'd look at something bright, it would look green, orange, blue, red. It would be very distorted. So they started using mirrors, but the mirrors they used at the time was made out of a material called speculum, which is mostly copper, and they couldn't polish them good, so they didn't work really good. So the good reflectors weren't made, the good, basically good telescopes were made from about 1850. I'd just like to thank the Litchfield Hills Astronomy Club for putting on the event and the White Memorial uh, Park for having the event. It's an awesome event. The kids are learning a ton of things. And it's, it's beautiful to, to come here and be safe, so thank you. Thank you very much for having hosting the solar eclipse. It was great. We, uh, for people who are unprepared, we were able to see so much. Look up. See the sun? Oh, no.